Hey guys, today I'm headed to Mexico's Isla de las Muñecas or Island of the Dolls, which I've heard is very creepy, so let's go check it out. Deep in the canals of Mexico's Xochimilco lies a disturbing omen to a mysterious and tragic past. Here, a small island, which can only be reached via an arduous two-hour boat trip, lined with hundreds of deformed, decapitated, and sinister-looking dolls exists. The Island of the Dolls was created by a man named Julian Santana Barrera, who was looking to move away from and escape society on a secluded island. When he arrived at his new island home, he found the body of a young girl, lying face down, lifeless in the water. Soon after, he found a doll floating in the same water and hung it up to a tree to show his respect for the deceased little girl. He quickly began hearing strange, unexplainable noises in the night. He feared the little girl had returned to his island to haunt him. To appease her spirit, Julian began collecting and displaying dolls around the island. He practiced this for 50 years until his death, which adds further mystery to the legend. Julian's lifeless body was discovered by his nephew face down in the water in the exact spot he had discovered the little girls all those years before. Today, many believe that Julian's spirit has returned to haunt the island of the dolls along with many others which already existed there. The island is claimed to be one of the most haunted places in the world with dolls that talk and move on their own accord. To visit the island, you'll need to take a boat from Xochimilco's Embarcadero Silada. Tourists beware of imitation islands that have been set up by locals to cash in on this legend. For more tips on how to visit the island, head to amyscrypt.com which is linked in the description below. Thank you so much for watching. If you're looking for some info on how to get to the island yourself, I've linked a blog post below on amyscrypt.com. If you enjoyed this video, please like, comment and subscribe. But until next time, stay spooky.